You want to go? Huh? You want to go? He's ready. <laughs> Come on. Let me at him. Put me in, coach. Put me in. So this is Jeff. Jeff is an industrial robot arm. Uh, he weighs about 5,000 pounds. He's capable- Lightweight. Of, yeah. He's capable of pulling, at least so far, up to around 575 pounds of force through this shackle right here. Okay. This right here is a uh, 3D gloop test sample. It's about two inches of square surface area that's been glooped together. It's just a simple little butt joint. And uh, we have it connected to a load cell where we'll read out the value here. The aim of the game with this is to either stall Jeff by pulling so hard, you put him into safety, or you break this shackle. You think you're ready? Has he ever been up against a Florida man before? I don't think so. Uh -huh. <laughs> Are yeah, you ready? Is, no. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna count you in. Three, two, one, pull! All right, looks like we got 140, 150. Come on, give it all you got! Uh. <laughs> I am, yeah, I'm, uh. I'm, I'm in a full <laughs> sit. Huh. You're, you're at about 100, man. You're doing pretty good. Oh, no, no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh. oh, man, you can keep going. He Jeff, you're an honorary Florida man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man. He's toying with you now. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. Boy, you're this is turned out crap. No, oh, and that's it. Boy, this is turned crap. That's it. <laughs> Man. Woo. How was it? Yeah, you know, that's a friggin' powerful robot. <laughs> Man. And that's just with this little that, test sample that's it. right here. That's all it is. This little tiny test sample. Yep. And you got that really awesome load cell in there. Yeah. Dude, that is super cool. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's taking a lot of work. You oh. know, Jeff uh, Jeff is still new to the team, oh. but uh, we're learning how to learning how to work him and uh, you know, he, I'm hopefully out of breath from this. Hopefully he'll uh, he'll he'll come to many other shows. I got I got <laughs> up to 150. That ain't bad. Yeah. I'll take it. I mean, I got an extra 30 pounds on my back. <laughs> <laughs> Yesterday, the uh, the max weight was uh, 575 pounds of force. But how many people? With three people. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I was uh, I was actually really impressed with Jeff. Um, we've only personally tested him up to around 420 pounds. So he. You never like tried to pull your truck with him? No, we have not yet. <laughs> come on. <laughs> now, where's the name come from? J E P H S. So that stands for just enough physical force. Just enough, huh? Just enough. <laughs> just enough, he says. A little, little a, more a, than just a, enough. A little bit more, but you know, we we, we have fun with him. <laughs> yeah. In next shows, he'll have uh, he'll have the winch fully operational, so it'll uh, add a lot more dynamic movements. <laughs> um, so that way, Jeff can winch in. Yes. Yeah. No kidding. Is this all custom? This is all too? custom engineered. Yep. Look at that. Yeah. This uh, this winch is designed for around uh, 1,200 to 1,500 pounds. Um, Child's play, really. Yeah. Just you know, having fun. You gotta have the googly eyes. Yep. Yep. This is awesome. Seriously, thanks for bringing Jeff out, guys. Yes. Check out. I am so out of breath. <laughs> I am so out of shape. Uh, this is what happens when you get injured, and I'm like. You know, I wouldn't do this unless we had a YouTube channel, so can we at least get a like for that? I mean, come on, that, that's, that's worth it, right? I think so. Guys, check out 3D Gloop. Links are in that description down below. And look, it handled at least one whole Florida man. That's why it's the strongest glue on earth for your 3D printers. Seriously, check out 3D Gloop in that description down below. Andrew, thank you so much. Thank you. Awesome. Where's Jeff going to be next? So uh, right now, I think this is his last show for the year. Um, but uh, I believe we're working on some plans for Rocky Mountain Rep Rat Festival. Nice. Uh, and I think after that, probably Murph. But we're, we're still waiting. Uh, and then at some point, Open Sauce 2024. So what you're saying is Florida Man's got to get all swole. Yes. So that I can go up against Jeff. Yes. And I got to find a way to break the glue. You gotta find a way to break the glue. I'm gonna reverse engineer it and bring my own solvents for it. <laughs> I mean, yes. <laughs> maybe, maybe we should have better security around him. <laughs>
I mean, honestly, if Southwest, could, would Southwest consider this my second check bag? Because like, I might have to pay an overage fee. He probably will yeah. have to pay an overage fee. I mean, you know, he's, uh, I, the robot arm itself is around 3,800 pounds. The base is another, you know, probably 1,000 pounds, give I, or take. I, I pulled at least that. The editor yeah. will show it on the screen. Yeah. yeah I pulled at least that. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. I agree. <laughs> we were talking off camera. It's like, at what point in your life did you ever <laughs> realize that you would own an industrial robot arm for nothing more than to play tug of war with your friends to show how strong your <laughs> chemical adhesive is for 3D printing? You know, I had this idea. It was crazy. We got invited to open sauce, and I needed some spectacle <laughs> to show off our adhesive. And I was like, you know what, tug of war, we've done that before. We've done it at, uh, at Murph. Mm -hmm. uh, it's fun, but- Yeah, but it's normally just two people. It's normally two people. Yeah. And it's just like, it's not spectacle enough. Right. And I'm like, you know, William Osmond is, is the William Osmond is putting on this show. Right. And, you know, Mark Rober's gonna be there. Adam Savage was there, you know, Alan Pan. I'm like, I've got to do something with robots. I've got to figure out something. Showing and I off said, to you all know the what? people we look up to. I'm yeah. like, you know what? I'm like, how cool would it be to play tug of war with an industrial robot arm? This it was like, crazy. This is one of those thoughts you have after maybe a drink or two. Maybe you've been huffing yeah. a little too much gloop and you're like, <laughs> you know what'd be really cool? Freaking industrial robot arm. Yeah, the intrusive thoughts one. I am totally, <laughs> but see, these, these are the right kinds of intrusive thoughts, ladies and gentlemen. If you have intrusive thoughts like this and you have individuals around you that will support said intrusive thoughts, both financially, physically, and uh, mentally, <laughs> Go for it, because I support the hell out of this. This is awesome. Thank you again, Andrew. Thank Guys, you. check out Gloop in the description down below. This is, uh, this is a crazy one. Well, guys, Jeff here and I, we're going to get out of here. This has been an awesome day, too, over at the East Coast Rep Rap Festival. Stay safe out there. Don't forget to call your loved ones. And thank you to all of our channel supporters who made this trip possible. And as always, keep making awesome. Have a good one. You know my outro, don't you? I don't. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm no sorry. Thanks was the only one that got it. All right. <laughs> oh, this is <laughs>